Good morning. Honestly, I don't understand why this is happening right now. I talked about it a few days ago. It was in Swedish media. This investigation that was done, 99 million people, and they looked for the side effects. What happened to people when they took the needle, right? Now, I can't explain it, why they are doing this now. It is the CDC. They said we need to look into this. CDC, United States. You know how they pushed the needle? It was ridiculous, right? That this is safe. Everybody should take it. You know, it was brutal, wasn't it? So they now say we have to look into it. And they did. Well, they asked Big Pharma to do it. So Big Pharma did the investigation. Well, this is, of course, like asking the fox about what happened to the chicken. <laughs> so we asked the fox, you expert fox, can you tell us what happened to these chicken? And the fox will say, well, these things happen. You know, sometimes these chicken fall over and their heads fall off. <laughs> you have to expect this. And this is what they are saying now. These experts, see, they control the discussion now, and I think this is, maybe, I'm guessing, but this is why they are doing it. It's like the pressure is on them, and they, they don't want to be exposed by others, so they sort of expose themselves now. <laughs> and make a report, and then they can have their experts being interviewed about this, and these experts say, well... This is to be expected from needles, you see? Maybe this is why they are doing it. But it's not a really good explanation. You know, they have been lying about it, denying everything up until now. There was nothing wrong with the needle at all, right? But now all of a sudden they present this report. So, uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm, go I'm going to read you from the list of side effects. It's a long list. They looked at a few things, right? Uh, but it's, uh, it's a big list anyway. So, swelling of brain and spinal cord from Moderna's first dose. It's a 3.78 times high risk from Moderna's first dose. So this is how this works. Uh, blood clots, AstraZeneca, 3.23, Guillaume-Barré syndrome, terrible stuff, AstraZeneca's first dose is a 2.49 times high risk. Uh, you know, it goes on and on. Myocarditis, Moderna's second dose, 6.1 times. Pericarditis, AstraZeneca's third dose, 6.91. Right. So, well, the numbers are very, very bad. But of course, I am very suspicious about these numbers. Because it's the Fox doing the investigation, of course. So they are, I'm sure, much, much higher. And there's no mention of people dying or getting cancer. Nothing about this. Right. So what does it mean? I don't know. Well, I know one thing. It means uh, your former friends and family and people who accused you, ridiculed you, and said that you were a tinfoil hat. Right? <laughs> well, they know now. I would like to hear them say it now. You know, these idiots who called me names for warning about the needle. Go on, say it again, that I'm a tinfoil hat. Just say it. All right? That's what it means. I'm sure about this. I've been thinking about it now, recently. I was wondering, you now maybe now, exactly now, is the time when people are starting to understand that they were fooled and I think it's true. It depends a lot on media. 
how much they write about it. As I said, they should be wild about this story. And these politicians, they should come out you know, and apologize, of course, and they should face the consequences. But I don't think this will happen. But uh, I'm hoping now that people will start to understand that this, this was all true. What, what you said and what I said, you know, there's something seriously wrong with this needle. I think this is what it means. <laughs> All right. Be good.